Hey guys, it's Mandy. Um, I thought I would come on here today and do um, a little change in chat video. I have um, my beautiful little Betty Rose in front of me. She is the Emmy Asleep Sculpt by Bountiful Baby and um, her cuddle body and her lashes were done by Heavenly Angels by Virginia and then her head was actually painted by Maple Lane Reborns. And I thought today we could talk about New Year's resolutions. I know every year we probably all set New Year's resolutions for ourselves. And so I'm curious about what are your guys' New Year's resolutions? And what made you decide on that resolution? Do you have any New Year's resolutions that have to do with your nursery and your reborn babies and dolls? Do you have any New Year's resolutions that are for you personally? And if you want to share them, let me know down in the comments below what those might be. I especially want to know if you have any resolutions for your collecting. For all of you doll collectors and for all of you reborn and dolly mommies or daddies. Do you have any any particular dolls or sculpts that you really want to add to your nursery in 2022? Do you have any particular artists you really want to adopt from? You know, if you've got any, let me know. I'm just really curious because I've got I've got a couple. So I'm going to change this little girl into something very, let's see if this, I think this will probably fit her. This is a really cute, colorful little sleeper that I got at Once Upon a Child. It might be a bit large on her. This is three to six months, so this might actually be a bit large on her. You know what, we'll save that for another time. So, my New Year's resolutions as far as personal is, um, you know, I always say I'm going to lose weight. This is going to be the year I lose weight. And I have lost weight in the past with different resolutions. And, um, you know, it sometimes it sticks. There's little Miss Fazzy. She's going to come see Miss Betty Rose. Hi. Hi, baby girl. Oh, I'm scratching her butt, and she's doing this hilarious little thing with her mouth. She's like, nim, 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 nim. Yeah. Hi. You gonna talk? She loves the babies. She absolutely loves them. She loves cuddling with them. She's a good kitty. Not like Odin, who's my bad kitty. But, um... I decided this year I would be a bit more generous with myself and a bit more kind with myself as far as personal New Year's resolutions go. Um, I have set for myself for a healthy New Year's resolution. I've set the, I like this little long sleeved onesie with them. with mittens built in. It's perfect for um, cuddle babies. Like little Miss Betty Rose here. Um, for my personal resolution, I've said that I want to move more. Um, I'm not going to set a resolution that I'm going to lose 50 pounds. I'm going to diet. Um, I've decided that I'm just going to set one as far as my health goes and that resolution is simply to move more. Um, 
I've started doing a little routine in the morning where I put on some music and I just dance <laughs> around my house while I do some house cleaning and it you know it makes it fun to clean if you're grooving to some music and it gets my heart rate up it gets my um I'm doing kind of like just fun like freestyle just sort of <laughs> that kind of dancing where I stretch my body while I'm doing it so it gets some stretching I'm mixing a little yoga in there and um it's been pretty fun this is a really sweet sleeper this actually came with her in her box opening it's got an adorable little um let me see if I can sorry guys Oh, sorry. Little teddy bear and little adorable teddy bears on the feet. She looks so pretty in pink. So that's my personal resolution is to dance more. So my, my Dolly and Reborn collecting um, resolution is to start investing in some sculpts that I really, really want to have. I have largely purchased budget babies. Um, budget babies helped me learn what, what really moves me as a reborn mommy and collector. Um, it's helped me learn what artists I really love to adopt from and some artists that I should avoid. I think I buttoned that correctly. It goes down the left hand side of the body, but I think I, let's, let's lift her up and see, isn't she beautiful? So um, she was kind of, you know, she arrived on New Year's Eve but she, um, I've wanted this sculpt for a while, but I wanted it done really, really well. And, you know, I, um, I, I, I invested in this little girl and I'm, I'm really, really happy with her. So part of my 2022 resolutions are to invest in artists that I really like and in sculpts that I really, really want rather than just, oh, that baby's on sale. Let's buy it. And, and there's nothing wrong with that, but you know, but that process has taught me what I like and what I don't like. Um, so, um, she was kind of part of that. Um, my beautiful Daphne was definitely Part of that she came uh, earlier and then I purchased my first baby from Buckingham Babies by Angie who is amazing 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 and I had word of mouth from my um, my uh, dolly sissy Anne you know that she was amazing and I, I currently have a baby who just arrived from her Okay, I am going to put this, she came with this cute little candy striped headband, so that's going to go on all my stars. Look at that. Oh, look at that. You guys, let me turn it to the other side so you guys can see just how, how precious she is. She's so beautiful. So, so yes, so sculpts, I really, truly want artists. I really, truly love and want to adopt from. And I'm now going to change another baby. I am going to change little Miss, let me get her settled a little bit better. Little Miss Our Bonnet. Little Miss Feyre River. She is also a cuddle body. And she's also 20 inches. Let me 
scan out a little bit more. There we go. I'm going to take this and it off her. I think that other sleeper might actually fit her. She is a little bit longer than, um, than Emmy, than Betty. Yeah, it's still gonna be way too big. Way too big. Okay. Maybe I won't change her. Maybe we'll just maybe we'll just finish the video with just just admiring <laughs> my one of my absolute let me just I'm just gonna kind of like swing her around and just hold her. Just love on her a little bit while I talk to you guys. I will pan back into her face because she's really beautiful. This is this is one of my budget babies that I am totally in love with. Um, she's the Dominic Sleep Sculpt. She is a cuddle baby. Her name's Feyre River, and she was reborn by Marie's Reborn Nursery. Um, so, I have a, a Cassie Brace sculpt right now that I am um, making payments on. She's in Lailway, and um, she is from a BB4U nursery who is the artist who did my Leia, um, my little Christopher Sleep, and um, this sculpt is... I, um, when I first bought Luke from Kelly, she had had this, I'm not going to tell you what sculpt it is, because I want it to be a surprise, but she had had this particular sculpt, um, on her page on Reborns.com, and she had, it was one of her adopted babies, and I thought that the, it's an open eye baby, and I thought that the little facial expression was just... Oh my gosh, incredible. And so I've really wanted that sculpt, but it, it is, it's not cheap. It's, you know, it is, Cassie Brace is a really amazing sculptor. And um, uh, Jeannie, who is the artist for a bb for You nursery, she's really amazing. And she, you know, she can charge the kind of prices that that, you know, are warranted for, for her level of work. Um, she's the one who did my Christopher Asleep, who is that tiny, delicate little baby that I named Leia. Um, this is a bigger baby. I think she's about 20 inches, but yeah, but I've got her on Lailway, so that's kind of, um, I'm really excited to get her. It's gonna take a little while. Um, I think I'm going to have her paid off within, maybe by the end of the month, I'll have her paid off. So, um, my next goal after that is I would absolutely love to have a, um, I would love to have a baby from Misty at Kids to Cradles Nursery. Um, she is an amazing artist, and um, her babies are pricey, but they're but they're gorgeous enough to warrant it. I'd really love to have a um, a June seven months awake. I would love to have a June three year um, toddler. Those are both from Bountiful Baby. Um, I'd love to have a Saskia at some point. I think I have definitely begun to love open eye babies a lot. Um, and um, my goal for my kind of like resolution for this year, and this is kind of a, a financial resolution too, is to um, not buy any baby with a credit card. I have purchased, I have adopted several babies with credit cards 
<laughs> so part of my financial uh, New Year's resolution and my doll collecting uh, resolution is to um, only adopt babies with money that I actually have in my checking account. <laughs> um, and to only um, adopt babies that are um, that I can you know that I can afford with money that I have and not to spend too terribly much on 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 dolls I didn't this year but I didn't last year but anyway well okay I think that's probably long enough for this video so we we had a good chat, so tell me what your doll collecting resolutions are. Tell me what your um, what your personal resolutions are, if you feel comfortable sharing them. Um, so I will talk to you guys later. I love you all. Thank you for being here with me. Um, I think I'm up to like 85 subscribers now, which just blows me away. Um, so I just thank you all for just sharing this 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 very like precious part of my life and being here with me so i will talk to you guys all later and until then take care take care of each other and see you next time bye